We are back for part two of her refurbished dresser chair set. Paige Hemis, way to go. You just really crushed this thing. Yeah. Well, thank, thank you, you very much. much. It's one job. of my favorite things. It was done. already kind of crushed. Yes. And then we just crushed it in a good way, yes. <laughs> well, last week, this is what she did. She transformed an old dresser chair into a chair. Yep. Um, into this. Right? Yes, and you can kind of see that old one, it, it was a bit wonky. That top drawer didn't really fit mm -hmm. in. And mm -hmm. I tried and tried. See Finally, it. I say, forget it. Right. And we turned it into this. Well, now we've got that extra drawer, and we fixed it up a little. And I got started on it earlier this morning, and I want right. to share that with you. All right. So I took the drawer, measured it, because right now it's just a drawer. We don't know how strong it is. I want to make sure we reinforce that. So I took three quarter inch plywood, put it on the bottom. This is the bottom of the drawer. And using our friend, the nail gun that Christina now is a expert yes. at, <laughs> I went all the way around to secure that. So that's the bottom. Now these are, I'm attaching the hardware for what you call bun legs or bun feet. They're actually a form of table leg. And it makes it so easy. Once you screw those in, all you have to do is screw in the bun leg. So easy, anybody can do this. If you know how to use a drill or even a screwdriver, it's easy for you to use. Now this is the same B board we used inside our dresser from last week. I, I, tr I measured it, made it a little bit taller. You can kind of see it's just a smidge taller, about a quarter inch taller, why because I'm gonna show you why that's important. So I put the B board all the way around, and then just to kind of pretty it up, I took the old knobs and put cute little crystal ones on. I took them off those, set them aside, mm -hmm. because then I painted it. Uh -huh. And then you can see the little knobs yeah. down there. That nice. added the little crystal knobs. So now last week, if you remember, I showed you guys how to make the seat. Yeah, right. right. And so I had leftover stuff. I used the batting. I made that. So you guys, you're pros at this. Mm -hmm. Now, because this is going to be a storage ottoman, I want you to be able to lift this off. But if you lift it off and it looks like that, yeah. you know, it looks tacky. It looks ugly, yeah. right? Yeah. So speaking of tacky, mm -hmm. let's tack it into place, okay. shall we? Shall we? OK, so wow. because you are a pro at this, just in the corners, actually anywhere you really want. All right, watch the fingers. OK, yep, perfect. Excellent. Do you glue something like this ahead of time if you. Did you say glue? Tack, yeah. A lot of people love the glue. I. You do not. I'm not a big fan. <laughs> no. Yes, but definitely you could glue it. It would it'd probably hold a little bit longer. I think so. she's um, a little bit overzealous here with the nail gun. I think you're good. <laughs> right? I think you're good. I think you need to blow it. <laughs> there you go. That's right. Okay. So, so now. Uh, who are you? Oh, very nice. <laughs> I'm so excited I learned. Well, wait, okay. it's a storage ottoman. So, oh, wait, oh, let's store to. some things let's in there. To. Oh, yes. Here's very Mark's nice. diary. <laughs> I'm going to need to read that later. And yeah, here's that's... a pillow and, and here's a blankie. Anything that you need. And then, could you grab that side? We'll yes. just put it over. Hang on a second, because she's not going to want to get what? this anymore. There we go. Oh, <laughs> nice. Look she's at that. She's done with that for today. And there, no, I will find it fits it. right into place. Then you and I can have a sit down. We can Perfect. put our feet a up. Snack. Yep. Look at there. Mark, could you bring oh. us some tea? Sure. Yeah. Sure, I'm absolutely. a little hungry too. If you I have. don't know what I get. Get some rest of the osso buco. I get. Okay. 